With our revolutionary nano capture technology, everything that you dream or think about during your sleep will be recorded directly onto the tiny hard drives installed in your memory foam pillow. These hard drives will instantly send the files to a cloud-based database where you can access them whenever and wherever you want. For perfect comfort, perfect support, perfect sunset, for a good night's sleep you'll never forget. Perfect sunset memory foam pillows, for a good night's sleep you'll never forget. Mother, I've told you, stop letting yourself in. You're knocking. It's my flat. Maybe you should start locking my door. Mum, you let me stay in the flat, right? Anyway, I don't need to lock the door. I'm only a few feet away from it. Better say some sorry. I bought you some supplies that I thought would be of benefit. There are some tins and some other little food bits. And then I popped in a few of my old women's weeklies just in case she wants to flick through. They had a good sock pattern. Give it a go. Thanks. I can't shop for myself, you know. <laughs> Maybe you should try it then. I do. I do. Oh. Have you found a girlfriend yet? Maybe that will sort your life out. I'm working on it, Mother. Just like you were working on that English degree. How have you been sleeping? Fine, I suppose. Well, I mean, not any different to normal. Why? You look a little tired. Maybe that's why you haven't got a job or a girlfriend yet. I have a job. Then why aren't you at it? Because I'm not meant to be right now. Well, in the cancer research the other day, I found this. It's one of those perfect sunset mum pillows or something like that. Yeah, it's just perfect sunset. Well, it's supposed to be good for your sleep. You know, they're meant to get rid of all those bad dreams or something. Jackie at Bingo was telling me all about their tech. It's a bit over the top, but I think there's something in it. Just sleep on it. Sure. Leave it on the table. Right, well, I'd better be off. I've got a lunch date with Jackie and Kay. I'll see you later. Try that pillow. Will do. Love you. Love you too. Looking at a bright overcast day today but there will be a rainy front rolling in tonight. That's all from me, Basil Allman. Back to Bob and Sue. Yeah. 
sunset memory foam pillows. Registered trademark, Healthline. Sam here. How can I help you today? Yeah, hi. Um, I'm Frank. Hello, I'm... Frank. My name's Sam. How may I help you today, I Frank? I received one of your memory foam pillows yesterday, and I just had the weirdest dream last night. Um, is this normal? It's an odd question, but I thought you might have an answer. I see, Frank. Did you purchase your perfect sunset memory foam pillow, registered trademark, from one of 500 licensed retailers? No. If you are unsure whether the retailer you purchased your perfect sunset memory foam pillow registered trademark from is legitimate, then you can always check our website for the full list no, of stores. My mum found it in a charity shop. If you received your perfect sunset memory foam pillow registered trademark from an unlicensed reseller, you may experience minor residual cognitive discharge. And um, that residual is? Residual cognitive discharge, RCD for short, is the result of a disconnect between the previous owner's memories being stored in the perfect sunset memory foam pillow registered trademark and the new owner's own memories. This causing the previous owner's memories to be received by the new owner's neural receptors as one's own memory. And is completely safe. Well, can I format the pillow's recorders or something? Not without a personal user pin. Pup, for short. And um, how would I go about getting the pup? Can you give me I'm a I'm sorry. Sharing users' personal information with unregistered third parties is strictly against the policies. Frank. Cheers. I'm glad I could be of assistance, Frank. On behalf of Perfect Sunset Memory Foam PLC, we hope that you will enjoy our product and remember that a Perfect Sunset Memory Foam pillow will always offer you <sighs> Good night, sleep. You'll never forget. Excuse me, what are you smiling about? Your story? About my granddad's funeral? No, no, sorry. <laughs> Bill? Frank? Well, you can stop your worrying, Mother. I found someone. A girl. Oh, do I know her? No. Well, I mean, to be... Completely honest, I don't fully know her either, but... You don't what? Well, you know that pillow you got me? Well, it turns out it was second-hand, right? So it had this um, residual discharge thing. Oh, my. Did it come off? I've always found that cold water with a dash of bleach does the trick. No, it wasn't like that, Mum. Um, it meant there were memories left in it. Memories of this, of this woman. OK. What do you want me to do about well, it? I always think I could find her. In the dream, she was always just so... Look, I just need to use the pillow again, and I'll be able to... Frank, dear. Has it crossed your mind how incredibly creepy that sounds? To use someone's memories to find a girlfriend? It's not like me to say this, but don't. Try to find someone who you've not mentally stalked. I guess. Good job, Frankie. Don't be a peeping Tom. It doesn't get you anywhere in life. Aunt Jackie knows a young lady who's looking for someone to hang around with. Perhaps you could meet up with her tonight and I can arrange something. Take your mind off things. All on your own tonight? Meant to be on a date. There uh, no show? I've, um... I've seen you here a few times. You go on a lot of dates. <laughs> yeah. You get lonely, yeah. On your own. Yeah. I get that too. Um... Do you mind if I sit here? 
No, not still. Um, I'm, I'm Frank, by the way. Oh, um, I'm Abigail. <laughs> nice to meet you. Abigail. It's a pleasure to meet you too.